I'm uh, Cindy. I am Wandering Mima. I bought Roz Van in September of 2021 and started doing my build. Build now in it is version 5.0. Um, and I have been traveling most of the time during the summer. I have a summer oasis that I stay at, um, but I still travel two or three days during the week. So this is the bed system that I came up with this time. It's uh, 74 by 24, perfect for one. <laughs> well, and you're tiny. <laughs> I'm tiny. Yep. Being 5'4 has its advantages. So this is the burnt wood um, system that I went with this time. And then I did the same thing on the ceiling, but <gasps> we stained the ceiling. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh my. Off so you can actually see the ceiling ceiling. Yeah. It's light in there. That is actually a RV fan that has a light on it. So I'm Oh I see. Now you yeah. know that I have the same one. It's an eleven by eleven, right? Yep. Yep. Doesn't put out a lot of air, does it? No, it does not put out a lot of air. Um, so I usually have my two little fans going here that I use. Blue Eddy. I have the Blue Eddy ACP. It's a, like a 300 or two, 200. 200 P. So I have 2,000 watts and I have 200 watts of solar on my roof. So do you ever have problems powering up your stuff? Yes. My power died last night, so I'm plugged in right now. Because we had all the clouds. We had all the clouds, yep. yep. And the only thing that really runs is the fridge and my lights. Or my uh, fan. So I cut by last night and got them. But... Can I see what you have around the back? <laughs> Harbor Freight hooks are godsend. Got all my stuff just hangs in there. Uh, my laundry basket goes right here. Just put my laundry clothes in there. My go bag for the shower there. My blanket. And then this I usually put on after. Oh my, these are very strong. Yeah. And, and you got magnets have, of everywhere you've been? Yeah, uh, most of the states. I don't have all the states, but yeah. I only have 13 states left that I haven't hit yet. So then that's the East Coast, and that's 759 days when I retire. Then we're going to do a East Coast uh, trip. But yeah, otherwise right now I'm making friends with people that live on the East Coast. I have places to stop and see. I see the panels are off, and that's even more storage. It is, yeah. That's a great idea. I was going to put um, actual, like, doors that go up and would make a shelf, too. But I haven't gotten that far. So then what do you, you keep a lot of stuff under the bed? Oh, yeah. yeah, everything stores under the bed. Over here I have the baskets that have my clothes and my food. So clothes go in here. Uh, more clothes in there. All my food goes in here. I have a diesel heater that's in storage right now. So that goes underneath over here. But uh, I don't need it right now. So it stays in storage. So I need it. Just got off of. Oh, it's a zipper. That's wonderful. Yep. So it's magnetic. So it'll fit on there. I have an SUV tent that go that I use. I'm going to be stationary for a while. I'll set that up. That's my office, my kitchen, and my living. Then I have portable solar if I need it, which I probably should have set up yesterday. But As a woman traveling, what would be what would be a piece of advice that you would give to others? Get out there, love it, and enjoy it. Don't let the fear hold you back. I see that so many times with people. Oh, I'm so scared. I'm scared. I have not had... I mean, there are times when I've gotten somewhere and I just... The gut feeling is this isn't where I should be, and I just move on. And trust your gut, you'll know. But yeah, I've stayed, and you know, I've got some big tires. I can boondock in some pretty desolate areas, and I have never, never had a situation where I didn't feel safe. Tell us about your channel. What kind of things can we find on there? My channel is mostly for my grandkids. I do my Instagram stuff, and then I'll upload it for shorts. So um, it's a way for my, to inspire traveling and my grandkids, which has worked. I have one granddaughter that loves to travel and I think she's going to have the little nomad bug. Nice. But yeah, so eventually this will probably end up being hers because I um, plan to upgrade to a schoolie. So hopefully this will be something that she can carry on with. And 
What is these hooks? Those are where the door actually shuts. But those also work for my um, hammocks when I'm visiting my daughter. Because the hammocks will go from there to her door. And then my grandkids hang out in the moonlight. So your channel again? Wandering Mima. Thank you so much. Wandering .mima? I think it's just Wandering Mima. <laughs> or on Instagram, it's Wandering .mima. Oh, okay. <laughs>